up guys, this is Emily from Bubbly Monkey Gaming and today we are back in Life is Strange. Now, a lot of things happened in the last episode and um, I, I just want to say the cop is being kind of nice for us being so tired of all this accused shit. of killing a police officer. When will we like I'm just break? saying, like this cop is not like other cops. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but we're gonna assume that it's a good thing. Oh, shit. Is it morning already? Uh-oh, we've been here for a while. Haven't seen Daniel. Great. Now I can put on a fucking show. Yay, yeah, I did this last time, but it didn't save this part, so I'm doing it again. How am I gonna get myself blah, out of this blah, mess? Blah, blah, God, can she just shut up? All she, she really likes to hear herself no talk, doesn't she? Off. Likes hearing her They're southern accent everywhere. and all that crap. I'm not illegal. I'm a sovereign citizen. Well, 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 you know what? That's all I hear. What are you about now? I'm not gonna try and break him. There's no point. Not yell. It's been a long how am I going to get myself out of this mess? Good question. I'm not going to try and break it. What's up, pal? Except you're not really my pal, are you? Nope, you're probably the opposite. There you go. Looks like you need it. Thanks. Thanks, you're right. awfully nice. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. Should I drink it? Damn. Seriously? I hope oh, Daniel doesn't freak shit. out in here. Yeah. Coffee's gonna make me feel so much better. Might give you a little bit of energy. So... Jeez. That's quite a crime spree. It's hard to believe what kids can do nowadays. Killing that officer in Seattle. Vandalizing a motel room. Caught in a, another huh? weird explosion at a pot farm in California. Then you join a religious commune in Nevada. Hmm. Oh. Which ends up burnt to the ground. And we're not even halfway down the list. One of those things you could get away with. But not all that. It sounds crazy, but I can explain. Explain it to Agent Flores. She's on her way now. Uh, not she bad, spoke to your mother, asshole. who took responsibility for the church fire. That's not true. She had nothing to do with it, and you know it. Don't drag her into this, okay? She's a good person. Hey. What is going on with the shadows? It's not up to me, kid. Listen. I feel sorry for you. I really do. But... Ah, so this is all out of Denying pain. what you right. did will only make things worse. It wasn't my fault. None of this is his fault. All I did was try to survive. Yeah, I guess you did. You know, I read the report. You claim that Officer Matthew's death was an accident. So why didn't you wait for the police? No one, no one would have believed what happened. We didn't either. Well, it's too late now. Your case is filled to the brim with evidence. Good news is, your brother's too young to be prosecuted. He'll end up with your grandparents, if they want him. But you're facing a shitload of years between bars. At least he'll get a life. Uh-oh. Uh, what I don't get is how two kids can destroy so much stuff. I mean, anywhere you went, something blew up. Seriously. 
How? Daniel's awake. Those were just random accidents. Yeah, it's crazy, but it just happens around us. I can't explain it. Uh huh. Listen, we're not gonna say super villains. Once, let's not say that. Is an accident. Twice, is luck. Three times, is enemy action. Whoa! Uh, what is that? Sir, I don't think you should keep your ass in that seat. You okay? How do you feel? I, I'm okay. Just a little headache. Hold on. Dude, awesome. We gotta I got go. a cool bracelet now. All right. Hold up. Is he okay? I I wanted to rescue you, but I I had to use my power. I didn't want to hurt him. He's okay. Don't worry. Oh my god! Hey! This is Sean! Get us out of here! Sean, who are these people? Well, Carla and Diego. Shall we try to make peace with these morons? Well, hell no, are you kidding me? Carla and Diego. They came all the way from Mexico. He's up for the count. How the fuck did you criminals get out, huh? Maddie, don't. Good thinking, Daniel. Good idea, I yeah. Him? No, no, he's okay. He'll just wake up with a nasty headache. Okay. Oh, shit. Don't move. Don't shoot. Hands up. Do not move. Wait. Oh, boy, okay. Stay back, Daniel. Let me think. Sean, what do I do? Quick. I gotta find something to stop them. Get him! Get him! Don't them! Now! The chair! They're dangerous! Be careful! Do what we need to! Understand? I'm scared. Do something! The muck, dude! What's going on? Okay, what the fuck? Do not move! Don't do anything this stupid, This is our last kid. warning! Put him in there! Now! Okay! Uh, uh. Smart! Smart! Very smart! Okay! You're the oh, man. It just said kill and now I was like, move. no! No, we're not killing Sean, anybody! I think our things are in there! Hey! 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 Our shit is still here. Oh god, okay. Fine. Good news. Okay, let's open it. Quick! Let's Stop get out of here! That. Nice! Don't move. I'll be right back. Okay, but be quick. Okay, let's move it. Come on, Sean. We gotta go. We let's would be so dead if we didn't have Daniel's power. I hate that he has to use it for all this crap. Yeah. Okay. Exito. Take it out, Daniel. <laughs> oh my God. Don't. Time to go. Time to get out. Sean, drive! Oh, hey, we got the keys somehow. Don't know how, but we got the keys. Oh my god. <sighs> don't, no, don't breathe yet. Nobody is chasing us. Not yet. I'm sure we'll have company soon. Yeah, shut up, radio. Are we still going to Mexico? Yeah. Yeah. We got nowhere else to go. Uh-oh. Sean. 
It's the 4th of July. Our first one without Dad. You're right. Remember how he was so in the fireworks every year? He always made us go too early so we could get a good spot. I know. He is so corny. <laughs> he said he was proud to live in this country. I think I, I think I can relax now. I gotta move my hands off the keys a little bit. Shit. Man, there's some crazy stuff going on. Oh my god. Can we find that big hole in the wall again? Shit. What are we gonna do? Sean! Sean Diaz! It's over! Don't make this worse! Get out of the car! Slow! Wave your hands above your head! Do exactly what I say! You know that day in Seattle, the day Dad was shot? I think about it every day, and I would give anything to change what happened, but I can't. I'm sorry for my mistakes. I tried my best. I swear. Sean. I'm so proud of you, Nano. Just like Dad would be. We both learned a lot together. But you can make your own rules now. If we surrender, they will separate us, Daniel. And if that happens, promise me that you will always do the right thing, okay? Don't. Waste your power. Be smart like you already are. I don't want to be separated. Whatever happens, always remember that you're Daniel Diaz. I promise, Sean. So, how does the story of the Wolf Brothers end? because he's young and he's not old enough to be prosecuted, but da but Sean is. Oh God. 
What would I do? What would I do? I would throw. I think there's Torians right here. Here? But I, I could. You would hurt a bunch of people, and we don't get hurt it. people. That's not who we are. No. Exactly. We're not criminals. We're just kids. And we still have time to choose what life we want to live. You're my brother. And I love you. I... I love you too, Sean. It's gonna be all right. I promise. You promise? For real this time? I do. You'll get to go back We're to Claire the right and Steven. Thing. And you'll get to Just live there. And you'll... Try and remember what I taught you. I mean... Only the good shit. I will. I swear. <laughs> on your knees! I said on your knees now! I'm sorry about all this. Oh, We're gonna shut look the after your brother. Fuck up. <laughs> That's my word. You make sure he gets back to Clarence Steven, asshole. Sean! No! Sean! Oye, oye, oye. Come back. He's gonna be fine. Daniel! You're not a little wolf anymore. Never forget who you are. Never.
15 years after the events of the border. Lila? And it's Daniel. You got a lot of facial hair. <laughs> Somewhere, having your freedom taken away with, from you with nowhere to go. Oh my god, that would drive me nuts. Oh, oh my Lila, fuck. Fuck. Oh. Ow, my head hurts. I hope you guys 
eyes out. <laughs> That's some of the audio. Ah, he does still have it. I had, I had, I had, uh, I had my doubts for a second, but. It's the end, isn't it? It's the end, isn't it? Oh my god! to say. Not the, not the ending that I was hoping for, of course, but you know what? That's probably what would happen in real life. You know, life is strange. I, you know, there were, there were moments, there were times where, where things got kind of boring, um, especially at the, um, uh, um, oh, let me think, uh, which part was that? I think it was at the, uh, the weed farm, things got kind of like, I mean, that was, that was a fun episode, don't get me wrong, but it, it, it felt kind of like slow, some of the episodes felt kind of slow sometimes, but, Excuse me, oh god, <laughs> sorry. Overall, fantastic game. I, sh I really should play The First Life is Strange, honestly. Probably not on the channel, I'm prob I'll probably play it on my own time. Just so I can uh, understand the backstory with uh, Chloe and uh, her friend and uh, David. But, um, god. I can't, I, I kind of, I just want to like watch all the credits and let them all roll and just if anything comes to me, I'll say it, but I'm just going to enjoy this music and you're welcome to join me or you can skip ahead, whatever, I don't care. I'm just going to sit here and enjoy this music and watch all the credits because these people did a fantastic job on this game. So, so good. did pretty good, I thought. I don't know. I, I'm not really well versed in uh, voice acting, but I, I don't know. I thought most of them did pretty good. Uh, there, I, I guess there were some moments where I was like, well, that's kind of weird, but like, I didn't really notice anything, honestly. Man, this music is so relaxing. I want to listen to this now whenever I do homework. I'm just going to put on the Life is Strange soundtrack and just listen to that while I do homework now. Or like art stuff. 
God, this is so relaxing. And it really clears your head. And my eyes, too, because I, st I stopped crying. <laughs> There's so many people worked on this. So much, so much attention and love was put into this. It's amazing. Ah. I want to hug all of them. I want to give everybody a big hug. I want, I want, I want a hug. <laughs> I need a hug. I want a hug. turned out okay. Well, as okay as it can, it could be, you know, for the most part. God, I want to know what happens if you choose to plow through all those police officers. Here we are. We're at the end. A special message to the fans. The whole Life is Strange 2 team wants to express its sincere and humble gratitude for your amazing support, art, gifts, passion, and theories. And thanks for your patience while we were creating these, or while we were crafting these episodes. Once again, we are proud to have you on board this amazing journey. Keep howling. Oh. Oh, that's right. We gotta go through these. Okay, let's try to go through these, through these fairly fast. You decided to force the roadblock and Daniel accepted. You decided to force the roadblock and Daniel refused. Okay, you decided to surrender at, to the police and Daniel accepted. You decided to surrender to the police and Daniel refused. Overall, you taught Daniel to do his best to follow the rules of society, 65%. Overall, you taught Daniel to put himself and his brother first. No choices to compare. Oh, oh, whoops. Okay, continue. Uh, you did the treasure hunt and found so, found the hidden souvenir. You did the treasure hunt but didn't finish the quest. You refused to do the treasure hunt. Oh yeah, why would you refuse to do the treasure hunt? That that was the cutest thing ever. Uh, overall, you got closer to Karen, eighty-two percent. Overall, you kept your distance with Karen, eighteen percent. You wrote a caring note to Karen, seventy-one percent. You wrote a concile. Con 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 uh, I can't read. Conciling note to Karen. I, I don't know. You wrote a lukewarm note to Karen. You didn't even leave a note to Karen. You said farewell to Arthur and Stanley. 77%. You didn't say farewell to Arthur and Stanley. You said farewell to Joan. You didn't say farewell to Joan. You hugged Karen before leaving. 97%. Yeah, of course. You intervened to calm Diego's in the cells. Yeah. You stayed out of the argument. You freed the Mexican couple. You didn't open the couple's... Fuck! I thought there was- I thought there was something- but I st I went- okay, I go back, I went up to their cell, and it didn't show anything. Fuck! I wanted to open it! Damn it! I- 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 Ah! Oh, damn it! Ah! Oh, fuck. Alright, fine. You asked Daniel to open the vigilante's cell, you didn't ask Daniel to free the vigilantes. Yeah, no. Yes, Daniel, to take revenge on the vigilantes. You didn't hurt the vigilantes. Oh. Yeah, let's not, let's not hurt them, please. You asked Daniel to kill the officers and escape the police station. You didn't ask Daniel to kill the officers to escape the police station. Yeah, I was trying to avoid that at all costs by, like, scaring them with the mug and all that, whatever. Daniel was told off about the scorpion. 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 And stopped messing with it. Daniel was told off about the Scorpio, but kept on messing with it. Daniel wasn't told off about the Scorpio. Daniel managed to set up Joan's sculptures like he wanted. Daniel managed to set up Joan's sculptures with your help. Daniel managed to set up Joan's sculptures without your help. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um, uh, <clears throat> Daniel was concerned about hurting Officer Campbell. Daniel wasn't concerned about it. Uh, Officer Campbell. So these are all things like this. The those are all um, stuff that happens because of choices you made in the past, like way in the past, like in like the first, like three episodes, even the fourth one. 
God, Jesus. Uh, Daniel accepted to open the vigilante cell. Daniel refused to free the vigilantes. Daniel wasn't asked to free the vigilantes. Uh, yeah, we didn't stay long enough to figure that out. I was just like, go, 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 let's get out of here. I wanted to free the... the uh. Daniel accepted to take revenge on the vigilantes. Daniel refused to take revenge on the vigilantes. Daniel didn't have to lash out at the vigilantes. Okay, so this must be... These must be options that happen if you choose, like, more violent routes down in the past, like, in, in the earlier episodes. Daniel killed the officers when leaving the police station. Daniel knocked out the... Daniel locked up the officers in a closet. Daniel was forced to intervene because the officers got too close. Ooh, okay. Yeah, no. Let's just keep him in the closet. Thanks. Uh, Daniel was okay to kill the officers. Daniel was reluctant but forced to kill the officers. Daniel refused to kill the officers. Daniel wasn't asked to kill the officers. Okay, good. Great. Per perfect. <laughs> That's just good. Wow. Daniel can do some serious damage. Holy crap. Thanks for playing and following Sean and Daniel on their journey. Is that it? Ah, that's it! Oh. Damn it. Hey, sorry about that guys, my my camera died, which is, is better that it died now and not in the middle of the episode where things were important. Um, oh god, oh. This was a great journey. I'm really glad you guys could come along with me. I, I, I sincerely mean that, deep down in my heart. I, I don't know you, I, I, I don't know who you are, but those of you who keep coming back every day and watching my videos, even though I, I've, I've missed days constantly, even though I, I've made mistakes with audio or just technical issues, like, those of you who keep coming back every day, I hope you know that it means a lot to me. And, uh, I don't know why I felt like I had to say it, but thank you so much. Uh, but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the series. I don't know why it, this made me think of what I just said, but I, uh, I hope that I can produce more fun videos for you guys, and I, I hope that you guys are really enjoying these because I'm, I'm having a blast and I'm glad that some of you like I, I don't know I guess care about my videos it means a lot to me so thank you so much uh, if you guys want to play this for yourselves again I, I'll, I leave a link in the descri description below of the games that I play all the time. Um, play this game for yourself. Give it lots of love. I, I highly recommend it. My god. A, re a really, really, really beautiful game. And such a strong, strong message to it. Um, yeah. I guess, I guess that's all I, I want to say. I, I can't really think of anything else to say, you know? Um, but yeah, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this. I, I had a lot of fun. Uh, you know, overall, I had a really, really, really fun time. Uh, this was this was a great, great game. And I know I say that about a lot of games. I, I kind of tend to like anything I play. Uh, that's just me. Like, I, I'm not really super picky. I'm not a professional. Uh, but like, I, I really, this game will have a special place in my heart for a very long time because, my god, and I guess I really should have played the first game before playing this one, but I don't know, I, I just felt like, I, I was told that the, these two could kind of stand on their own, so I, I just kind of was like, oh, you know, I'll just, I'll just play it. You know, it's got totally new characters, I'm told. It's, that has nothing to do with the first one, so... You know, I... I... 
for what it's worth, I, I, and for all of my blabbing and talking forever and ever, I had a really fun time. Is basically what I'm trying to say. This this was such a fun game, and I highly recommend you go play it for yourselves. So, thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are awesome, and hopefully, I will catch you guys in the next video. Have a great day, you guys. Stay awesome and bubbly. Bye bye.